There's Shannon, Hi. all squeaky clean. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all the papayas on that tree. Just loaded. Another branch over here has papayas. This one here has a couple on it. That one right there. I <laughs> this one really pumps them out. They don't get very big. They, they only get about, I don't know, five or six inches long. About as big around as a baseball. But they're real good if you like papayas. You know, Shannon and Marafi, they eat, they eat a lot of papayas. Tweezers. Those big bees there, they they bore holes into trees and make their nests in the trees. Seem pretty friendly around people. I've had them run right into my chest before. I never. He's looking us over now. It's like, what are you doing by my flowers? <laughs> See that? <laughs> There's a hairy caterpillar there. Now caterpillars here are pretty nasty. Anyone with hair like that gives you all kinds of itch and slivers from the hairs on them. And uh, they're just absolutely vicious. Even the little teeny ones are really bad. Uh, there's also some big smooth green caterpillars, big moth caterpillars too, they're okay. But the, these hairy ones are real bad. There's a fresh fly trap in action. We had a dead chicken yesterday. So I cut the chicken up, put a, a piece in each one of the traps. See, there's only a couple on that one, but uh, they've done wonders. The, after the, after the, the meat starts to rot in there, and the flies go for it, and it gets to the point where we smell them, then I have an alternative spot. I just put them a little farther out in the edge of the yard, and the flies still go for them, and then we don't have to smell them. But very nice. If you watch my video of how to make them, it's very simple and very useful. I'm over here by the chickens, and I've got a fly trap up here, and a fly trap over there, a fly trap out here, and another one over there, and there's the caber chickens. Now, there's not really any flies here flying around at all. Um, the other day before I had the fly traps up, I put out a couple pieces of fly paper, and uh, this one here fell down in the sawdust, but the, I had one sitting right here, and it was just covered with uh, little black flies, so it was kind of nice. But right now, the, the fly traps are doing a good job. These chickens here, these are eating chickens here. You got one over here on this side that's an eater. This is two different sizes mixed together. And these here are all about a little over a kilo now too, so we'll have chicken once a week now for sure, maybe twice a week if we get real lucky.